Hi everyone! Before we begin, let me introduce myself briefly. I'm Maria Jane Shoko and I'm currently taking a Bachelor of Science, uh, Bachelor of Education major in Science, third year student. Today, I'll be talking to you about first, what is your cane? And second, how does or do your canes form? First of all, I'll, I'll explain to you what is your cane and what are the other terms uh, of hurricanes or storms depending on where they are born or can form and I'll finish it by giving you information what will be what or how does uh, hurricane starts with and I have a question do you have any idea about our topic today or have you ever felt or seen a hurricane maybe some of you are have the of you have the knowledge about hurricane and some are not but it's okay uh, let me give you some insight or information about hurricanes today we will learn about uh, hurricanes hurricanes is a huge rotating storm with a very speedy winds that forms over waters in tropical areas yes in tropical areas they are specifically in equatorial regions one of the place or country that can feel hurricane is the Philippines. Unfortunately, hurricane is not a term we use in the Philippines. We call it typhoon or bagyo. We also have the other definition of hurricane, where it is a very large and intense storm according to learning junctions. A hurricane is a huge storm which usually lasts for over a week, moving uh, 20, 10 to 20 miles per hour over the open ocean. Hurricanes gathers heat and energy through contact. Hurricanes are also called cyclones or typhoons. Did you know that we have different names of storms or cyclones according to places? We have the name hurricane where it is a tropical storm that form over the North Atlantic Ocean and Northeast Pacific. Some places are Canada, Italy, France, and Papua New Guinea. And other uh, and other places in North Atlantic Ocean and Northeast Pacific. We, however, we also have cyclones are formed over the South Pacific and Indian Ocean. Examples of the places are Australia, New Zealand, and Palau. We also have the typhoon that are formed over, over the Northwest Pacific Ocean, like here in the Philippines, China, and Japan, and other places. Hurricanes normally form within 5 to 15 degrees latitude north and south of the equator. Now I have a question. Did you know where hurricanes form and where do these giant storms come from? Hurricanes are very large and intense storms. Hurricane starts with a warm water found near the equator. Hurricanes usually form in tropical regions where the Oceans is at least 80 degrees, 80 degrees Fahrenheit specifically. This warm water evaporates, creating warm air, which acts as a fuel uh, in the storm. This wind causes even more of the warm water to evaporate into the air. The warm, moist air uh, then rises high into the atmosphere, atmosphere where it begins to cool. Then way up there, the water vapor condenses back into liquid, uh, forming into water droplets. Then the water droplets in the atmosphere then form clouds, including big stormy uh, cumulonimbus clouds, which we know that cumulonimbus clouds are, uh, they are the cause or um, uh, jana for form a uh, thunderstorm or the storms. As the warm air uh, rising upward, the wind begins blowing in a circular pattern around the center. The spiraling winds gather up a cluster of big thunderstorm clouds. Once the spinning of winds reach 74 miles per hour, then that storm officially became a hurricane when it reached 74 miles per hour. And that will be the end of our topic today. I hope you learned all about our topic, hurricanes. That would be all. Thank you.